Hey guys, Dave back here again. Um, the review I'm going to do right now is a Volcano Isig's Inferno. Um, I have the silver one. They come in black, red, and silver. They all have the same kind of design going on um, around the outside of it right here. Um, just going to go ahead and get into what they give you. Um, it's the same as most Ego kits, except for the fact that this one gives you the 650 mAh battery that has the USB pass-through on it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, it has a little cap on the end that you take off. You can plug the USB cord right into it. And then they also give you the 1000 mAh mega battery. So that's what I'm using here right now. My USB pass-through is on loan to a friend, so I don't have it with me, but I will do a separate video for it um, if I get a, a request for it. Um, but there is a couple differences from this kit that what you're going to get. You're going to get the same charger, the fast charger that you can use either for the plug into your computer or that you can plug it into the wall charger that they give you. They give you the USB cord for the pass through. They give you one atomizer. The difference in this atomizer is that instead of having the threads and the, I don't know what you want to call it, around the edge and on the inside and on the bridge, it has the copper washer. It's the old style ones that I haven't seen for quite some time now. Um, I was into vaping a while before I got into quitting, so I guess you could say that. Um, but they do have a lighter draw on them. I can't stand to have a light, light, light draw. It's, it's an extremely light draw. Um, but they are low resistance as well. They're not going to tell you that, but they are low, lower resistance than normal. So for one, the atomizers are going to give you a lighter draw. Two, they're going to burn a little bit hotter. Three, they have the copper washer. If that matters to you, fine. If not, you can find an atomizer that you can use on them just as well. Um, like I've said before, I'm a dripper. I got their anodized silver drip tip here uh, fits on really really nice in all the atomizers that I have um, on the inside or the middle I guess you could say here Let's see if I can see that get in there it's their Inferno logo and then also on the bottom they're going to have their logo on that as well so I'm gonna go ahead and take a hit off of this and show you guys how it performs performs really well. Um, not anything really different than a regular Joy Ego. This kit does go for $59.95. It's a little bit cheaper. You get the best bang for your buck on this one, quite honestly. Gives you the mega battery, gives you the pass-through option. You can take the pass-through off, put the cat back on it, and just go. Um, I haven't tried any of the juices that came with it. Um, they're 16 milligrams, which is too low for me. I'm still only a couple months into this. I still use the high milligram type stuff. Um, the juice that's in this right now is a 100% PG juice from a different website. So the vapor you're getting off of this is 100% PG, so it, it should tell you that it does work very well. I'll have a link in the description. This is from VolcanoEcigs.com. It's their Inferno. It is still fairly new. It's about three, four months old. Correct me if I'm wrong on that. I it could have came out a little bit sooner than that. But <clears throat> um, you get the, if you're a dripper, you can get the drip tips to match all of them. They have the red, they have the black, the silver, about five other colors, I think. Um, but you can't beat it. It's a, it's a really, really nice looking device. It is all metal finish, and I was a drummer for a long time. I don't know if that has to do with it or not, but I get sweaty palms a lot. And it does give a little bit of the weird, weird texture to it. Grim Green, if he sees this video ever knows what I'm talking about. So um, it does give you a little bit of a weird texture, but the button is the same as most of the Egos. has a little white LED on it. Um, it has a 10 second cutoff, I believe is what I found normally has it. The batteries for the Mega One take about an hour and a half to charge. The USB pass through, if you keep it plugged in to your computer or to the wall, it takes about half an hour to an hour to charge. So this was the Volcano Inferno from VolcanoEcigs.com. Head over and check it out. 